I guess you are watching this video because your computer is running with an issue here. As you are trying to run a program recently installed, this error arrived. The program can start because ZLib 1.dll is missing from my computer. It's a very critical error and all you need to do is watch this video till the end without skipping it. Hello everyone. Welcome to Tech Evolution. In this very short video, I will be fixing this error within 3 minutes. So, let's begin. The first thing you need to do is open your favorite browser and search for jetleap1.dll. You can choose any results you want. I'm choosing the first one. This is not sponsored, but I'll put the link in the description. Here you can see a few download options based on the architecture. To know your architecture, click on Start and search for system information. Here you can see mine is 64 bit. As I'm updated to the recent Windows update, I'm downloading the second one. I strongly recommend you to read this page, it has multiple fixing methods also. As the download complete, hit open. There you can see a few files. To move the DLL, open this PC, local link C. Windows and find a folder name System32. This is the home of 32 bit DLLs. Now drag the DLL and drop. I've already done this, so they are asking me to replace. And click on continue. Before we proceed, let's check. By typing the file, and you can see the file is placed in the folder right now. So, job is done for 32 bit users. You can go and restart your computer. Only just for 64 bit users, open this PC one more time. Local Dix C, Windows, and this time find a folder name syswow64. This is the home of 64 bit DLLs. Now click on the zip file, drag the DLL, and drop. Same again. Check this one more time. Yeah, it is perfectly placed in this folder. So, job done is for 64 bit 2. And finally, restart your computer. In extremely rare cases, if there are tlockers, you need to download and install MINZW and install your program again. And that will surely do it. And that's all. If you follow me step by steps, you will no longer have that problems left. Please let me know how you feel about this video and do not forget to like and subscribe.